Hi, this is Reagan, and this is my second video. I'm going to produce one every month for 12 months, a year, one rotation around the sun. And the reason why I'm doing these videos is because every year for about four years, I've done undercuts and let the top of my hair grow out and get really long. And uh, this year I said, you know what? I want to let the sides grow out too, because I want to be able to like pull it all back this way rather than have one of those samurai top knots um, yeah so that's my goal and I want to just kind of mark that journey through video uh, so I just I, I've been letting the top of my hair grow out for uh, a couple months now this is I think month 22 or 23 and as you can see the the top is kind of like getting to a longer phase right now but I've only been letting my sides grow out for the past two months. This is the two month point today, okay? And I saw a guy in Australia do something similar to this, which has been really helpful because it gives me an idea of like, okay, this is what my sides will look like in three months or four months or five months. So one of the things that he does that I thought I would also do is he takes, he actually like plucks, I don't know if you're gonna be able to see this, yeah. He plucks one of the hairs out of his side and then he measures it so you get a sense of like how fast the hair is growing. So I'm going to tell you uh, the hair on my side. Uh, hmm. I would say it's just shot, sorry, it's just shy of one and a half inches, I would say. So that's how long it is and I'm prepared. It's not quite at the ugly phase yet. In fact, I wanted to bring out this product that I've been using, which is the uh, Baxter Clay Pomade. It's a really, really good pomade. Um, it really leaves your hair where you put it. It's very thick, so you have to rub it in. That's not a euphemism. Don't rub one out, just rub one in. And then, oh yeah, this is not, I have to do it. So typically if I go like that, I can flatten it out a little bit so it's not quite so do this to refocus my camera because I'm not I'm an amateur I'm not a pro so it's just not sticking straight out that's the one thing that I hate about letting my sides grow out but I'm guessing that within the next month or two that my hair is gonna get wilder and I'm probably gonna have to start relying on caps a whole bunch more my guess is that I'm not gonna get to like a comfortable place for another three months so if today's January, February, March, April, like hopefully by the April video, I'll be feeling better about it and not wanting to cut my head off like Ichabod Crane. So that is where I'm at. And um, here's kind of like the 360 view of my awkwardly shaped head. I will see you in another month with longer hair. And if you are high tech, High tech, high tech. If you are letting your hair grow out um, and doing the same thing, I uh, wish you the courage and the perseverance to get through it. It is difficult going through these awkward stages, but I believe you can do it.